Hey, welcome to another study with me video, microbiology edition, where I study with you. In this video, we'll be studying catabolism and anabolism. Now, if you have any questions, put it in the comment section below. If you have any video ideas, I will make the video. So don't forget to subscribe and click that bell. So when your video comes up, you'll be notified. Now, anabolic reactions, they are the building of those complex large molecules from those smaller, simpler molecules. So we have our simpler molecules, and it's the building of large molecules. Now, in anabolic reactions, there is a process called dehydration synthesis. D meaning release Hydra is water It's the release of water The release of water when there is the building of a complex molecule from a simpler molecule. So we have two hydrogens and we have our oxygen. We have our simple molecules. So when hydrogen and oxygen meet our simpler molecules, and the anabolic reaction proceeds and we get our complex large molecule this will result in our large molecule and water now where does energy come in in anabolic reactions well energy is needed let's use a different color So energy is needed, and this is called endergonic reaction. So here I'm going to turn anabolism into our definition. So we're going to use the B in this one for build because anabolism builds simpler molecules into larger complex molecules. I'm going to use the N for endergonic so energy is needed in anabolism. Anabolism is the building of large complex molecules from simpler smaller molecules now in anabolism there is dehydration synthesis that is the release of water So we have anabolism that builds, endergonic energy is needed, 
and water is released in anabolism. Mm -hmm. 